What is up, Evil Dead fans? Let me get centered here. Come on. Work with me. Oh, look at that. Look at that sweet chainsaw right there. That is Marmy of Darkness chainsaw. That one will be in Chicago. I am bringing that one down to get signed by Bruce Campbell and Sam Raimi at Flashback Weekend in Chicago, August 2nd to the 4th. <clears throat> so if you want to see it in person, it will be down there. Um, a few things to cover. If you notice one thing, that is off about me right now is I'm drinking a Hefe beer and I'm gonna open it with my Ash vs. Evil Dead bottle opener. The battery's worn out on it. If I can open it, there we go. And the reason why I'm drinking a Hefe beer right now, folks, is because I have my Jacksonville Season 2 Episode 1 shirt. Now, this isn't the exact shirt that was on the show, but my good friend Triple X Goffman Triple X did a lot of research and tracked it down. <clears throat> now, these are for sale. They are being sold right now. So if you're a cosplayer and you want to do the Jacksonville Ash, you got to get one of these. Uh, he did a lot of research. I think the backstory on it was... Um, the material that made the shirts for Ash in season two, I, I, I could be wrong on this. He can clarify this a little better than I can. Got sold to a company, and what they did is they just started pumping out some shirts. Uh, they're selling large, extra large, and mediums. I got a squeaky ass chair. So, <clears throat> I'm going to have a Hefe beer. Now, if you're under 21 or whatever your country's drinking age is, do not drink. Ooh, that's good. But anyways, figured it's only suiting since I'm wearing this shirt. Um, <clears throat> but I can't give out the link to it. It's not my place to give out the link. If you want to know where to get one of these, you need to contact Triple X Goffman Triple X um, or find him on Facebook, Al Biardi. Um, I don't know if he's giving out the link to everybody. I know on the KOS, the Knights of Samaria page, he did give out the link over there. Now the shirts only cost, no matter what size they are, $6 and some change. And shipping is like $4. I think it ends up being $10.75 all together. And it's just fucking awesome. So it's 100% cotton. It's a little big, I got an extra large, but I got paint on me too today, as you can tell. It's not bird shit or anything. Um, I hope it's not bird shit, because that's a lot of it. Um, <clears throat> but anyways, I'm, gosh, it's a chair. Um, but I'm kind of in between sizes. Large would have been too small. And uh, extra large is a little too big. But these are 100% cotton, so one good wash, boom. It's gonna shrink up just perfectly for my size. A um, few other things to cover. Let's get to some stuff. I got some new stuff, and I wanna show off something I made. Now, if you're gonna be in Flashback Weekend in Chicago, you, you know already I'm gonna be selling two Ash vs. Evil Dead chainsaws. Those are my last ones. I did have three, but my, other, my third one went to a private collector across the globe. Now, they will have these bars on them. They look good. The reason why they look good is because they're screen accurate. You can see right there that it's just not painted on. This is actually engraved in and with the proper rivets, bolt right here, proper placement of these over here, the little extra holes. <clears throat> the chain is epoxied on, the barbs are gone, and it just fits right into the flywheel, bolts in, you look good. It's basically the same thing I did with uh, the lightweight chainsaw I did, except that one was basically just a black chainsaw bar with the hole in it since it was Evil Dead 2 uh, work shed scene. But this is Ash vs. Evil Dead. This is what you'll get. And it's nice and stiff, has a stiffener in there, so it doesn't wobble around, but looks good. And I got a few things from my man, Jason Wade Cox. Now, if you don't know this, if you're not on the Knights, if you're not on the Knights of Samaria page, you should be. They do contests and giveaways all the time. And you find out where to get really cool stuff, uh, screen accurate parts, props from the show. And this sweet ass Jacksonville shirt. <clears throat> So anyways, Jason Wade Cox had a giveaway where 
it was like a scavenger hunt and I won. And so what I'm getting is every poster. I'm getting Evil Dead, or The Evil Dead, Evil Dead 2, Army of Darkness, and I think, yeah, those are the only three. That was a grand prize. But anybody who won anything, you know, I think it was like first through the third, you know, first, second, and third place, also got a copy of Within the Woods. Now, if you don't know what is Within the Woods, this is what started Evil Dead. This is what they pitched to try to uh, make money for uh, doing the Evil Dead. So you give me a copy of that. And also, Black Coffee Artworks, Dead by Dawn. These are stickers that he sent me. And I got scissors here, I can open up. And it's by Black Coffee Artworks. Uh, follow them right there. That's where you find this kind of cool stuff. Let's break it open and see what stickers we got. Thanks again, Jason, you're an amazing dude. You and Bobby, man, I love you guys. And one day we will meet up. I swear to you, it will happen. And okay, let's see what we got here. So this sticker is Evil Dead. Probably my favorite sticker, actually. You got a chainsaw. Not screen accurate, but still pretty badass. This is more of like the, uh, if you did a tattoo of this, it's more of a cartoony look. You also have the book. Let's see what else we have. <clears throat> this is cool. It's an ax that says, kill her if you can, lover boy. That's pretty badass. I didn't want to open this up because it's such a nice package. Oh no, this is my favorite sticker. Dead by Dawn with the cross right there. Mm. And then yes, I did get this also from Jason Wade Cox. Thank you, Jason. And Bobby, of course. I always gotta thank Bobby too. I always gotta thank Bobby. But yeah, um, also going on the Knights of Samaria page, the rings are almost done. And I don't know how exclusive they're gonna be. You'll have to talk to Al about that. He's kind of in charge of that whole thing. Um, I know I'm getting one of those, even though I got one right there from the show. Um, but he was able to get a hold of a, a mail ring. It was the, what it was called, the Unnamed Knight. He was able to get that ring. And it was more of a cast of a cast. It wasn't like perfect like Dalton's or detailed on the sides like this one. Um, but we're going to work out the kinks. He's got the tops all done. We're going to work out the kinks with the side, get that done. It's going to be perfect. And like I said, I don't know uh, exactly where he's going to sell them or any of that stuff. But when I find out if he's going to do something other than just with the Knight's page... I will inform you guys and let you guys know if you guys want a Knights of Samaria ring. Also, 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 um, in Chicago, Roger from Ultravix Studios, he will be there as well. Um, I'm excited to meet Roger. He's a nice guy. Uh, and there's a lot of us going to be down there. A lot of us. Uh, Chris Pollock, of course he'll be down there. Also, Alex and Alex from Anime Creations possibly might be there. It's still up there. I've been talking to him about it. <clears throat> But yeah, <clears throat> excuse me, very unexciting video. It's not very exciting, except for the shirt, and it's getting hot in here, and I don't want to sweat in it, and a Hefe beer. But yeah, and still, if you want to buy one of my last two chainsaws, Mash vs. Evil Dead ones, the lightweight chainsaw, Accurate Bar, that's where it's going to be. It will be in Chicago, and I'm getting ready to mail those off to Chris, so they will be down there when I get down there. I'm not flying out with those things. I'd rather not get a thumb up my butt because I'm going through TSA with a chainsaw body. So not gonna happen. And also remember, if you wanna come take a look at the Army of Darkness and see that you can, it's got Chris's grill in there. Look how good that looks. Look at that. Imperfection can be perfection. But yeah, this will be down there. So if you want to come look at it, like say if you're doing a build on it and you really want to get close to the details, that's where you can come take a look. And I will tell you how to do different things here and there. Um, but that's really it, guys. It's a really quick video. I want to thank Al again. And if you guys want one of these shirts, you have to talk to him. If he, if he wants to share the link with you, he will. But these are going quick. And the price of this shirt is, like I said, it's, it's like less than $11.
because I know I got one, Al got one, I know one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eleven people for sure who got shirts, and they will not last forever. Whatever they had of this fabric, when they're done, they're gone. They are gone. And see, I actually ordered one for my good friend, um, uh, Joe. Cheers, Joe. Uh, he lives in Canada. I don't think they ship to Canada or, over, or overseas, but he will be in Chicago. So I ordered one for him, and he will have one down there uh, waiting for him. So if you want to do the Ash cosplay from Jacksonville and you want the shirt, uh, Al said there's something up with the pocket. I'm not sure. He said it might not have been there or something like that. If it's not there, I can just unstitch the damn thing. Or if it was supposed to be over here, just unstitch it and just stitch it back over here. But, yep, this is it. This is the shirt. Look how long it is on me. But, yeah, I'll uh, give it one good wash and then it'll shrink up. But, anyways. <clears throat> anyways. Um, like I said, talk to Al Biardi. Triple X Goffman Triple X. If you want one of these shirts... He may give out the link or not. I'm, that's not my place to do. I just want to inform you that it is out there. And he wanted to make sure other people within the Knights of Samaria page had this information first. So if you're not part of the Knights of Samaria page, I don't know why everybody, well, we're getting a lot of members actually, but I don't understand why a lot of people are hesitating. They're like, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. I don't, I don't have anything to share. We have members on there who don't post anything. And just to let you guys know, sooner or later, we're going to have a house cleaning. If you're just there to fart around and not do anything, um, there's a lot of people who share. And if you're a prick or an asshole, you're not, you, we don't want you. Um, everybody there is nice and kind. It's not like other groups of fandoms where they're like all, all up in somebody's ass over something. We're not about that. But if you're there and you have nothing, you don't have a big collection, but you want to do something. We have people who don't have the biggest collection, but they do live videos and we they chat and talk about things and we all interact together. It's an amazing Facebook page. That's why I've kind of slowed down on the videos here because I do a lot of stuff over there. And if you want like little exclusive things that I do that I don't share here, I share it over there. So definitely go with the Knights of Samaria page. It's the Knights of Samaria, fans of Ash Williams versus the Evil Dead. It's a great place. And thanks again, Jason Wade Cox, for this, my stickers, the posters that should be coming soon, and the movie. And remember, follow on Instagram, Black Coffee Artworks. And coming soon is the pin that Kyle Banks made. He's going to send it off pretty soon here. And the sticker. And I will post about that because it is amazing stuff. It looks so good. So once I get that, I'm going to show you guys that. And I am going to have them... Not them, but mine down in Chicago, and I will show you that. And then also I'm going to do a big unboxing with a lot of stuff that Al sent me that will be available in Chicago. But you have to be part of the Knights of Samaria page to receive any of this cool stuff. See, we're the Knights of Samaria, guys. We're, we're this. We're that. And even one of our members, Kurt Eubanks, was, did a recast of this ring. And even Dalton, the guy who played Dalton on Instagram... Personally knighted him. Yeah, that's how badass we are. That's how badass Kurt is. But anyways, I'm going to let you go. I am going to get everything done for Chicago. And happy birthday, Johnny, my friend. He's going to stop by here in a little bit. It is, it is his birthday, so I'm excited to see him. It's been a little while. But you guys, like always, I'm going to sit here and drink a beer. The Hefe. I could write. Do I got a marker? No, I don't. I could write L right here. El Hefe. I'm going to have my jefe, and you guys, stay groovy.